House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi D. Califf, speaks during a news conference on Capitol Hill in Washington on June 9. Democratic Party divisions are on stark display after a disappointing special election loss in a hard-fought Georgia congressional race. J. Scott Applewhite AP, narrow losses in two House special elections had Democrats once again trading recriminations Wednesday and pondering anew whether their leaders have them on a path back to power. Especially painful was John Ossoff's three-point loss Tuesday in Georgia's 6th congressional district after his campaign was buoyed by more than $23 million in donations, much of it from grassroots Democrats across the country eager to oppose President Trump. That funding surge was blunted by millions of dollars worth of TV ads and mailers from Republican Victor Karen Handel and from outside GOP groups. A common theme in those efforts was to tie Ossoff to House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi. D. Califf. A figure both well-known and widely reviled, according to Republican polling. That had Pelosi's Democratic critics rekindling their calls for new faces atop the party caucus, warning that Democrats could squander their chances of retaking the House majority in next year's midterm elections. Rep. Tim Ryan, D. Ohio, who unsuccessfully challenged Pelosi in House leadership elections held after the November election, said that even talented candidates cannot overcome the toxicity of the national Democratic brand. It makes it 